Hallo meine Lieben und herzlich willkommen. Es geht weiter mit Walking Dead äh, Season 2. Und ähm, wie ihr vielleicht sehen könnt, heute mal ohne Facecam, weil ich muss ehrlich sein, ich hatte einfach gar keinen Bock heute auf Facecam. Und ähm, deswegen seid mir bitte nicht böse. Äh, es geht ja nicht um mich, sondern um das Game. Und deswegen, ja, in der letzten Folge sind wir hier stehen geblieben, wo die Dame hier reinkam und meinte, bitte lass das Kind von ihm sein und gesund sein. Ja, hier drin haben wir anscheinend nichts. Dann gehen wir mal wieder raus. So, jetzt gehe ich mal wieder zurück zur... Sarah hieß die, glaube ich. Hey, Sarah? What are you still doing here? I need to find some bandages. I don't have any. Um, maybe try looking in another room. But be careful. They'll be mad if they find you sneaking around. Thanks, Sarah. We're friends, right? Right. Okay, dort haben wir keine Bandagen, also Verbände sozusagen. Dann schauen wir mal hier nach. So, was haben wir dann hier? Schreibtischschublade. Oh, eine Uhr. Nehmen wir mal mit. Ich weiß zwar nicht warum, aber wir beklauen sie tatsächlich. Lumpen. Okay, gut. Geh zurück zum Schuppen. Ich will aber hier noch ein bisschen gucken. Okay, hier haben wir sonst nichts. Oh, ich hoffe, wir werden nicht erwischt. So, schnell die Treppen runter, schnell. Runter. Äh. Oh, es quietscht voll. Man hat voll Angst, dass die uns hören, weil es so quietscht. Oh, shit. Schnell, lass uns hier verschwinden. Oh, die Kleine tut mir sowas von leid. Ach, da sind wir auch schon. Das ist ja genial. Die Arme, ey, tut mir so leid. Das ist gonna suck. Ja, allerdings. Ich würde sagen, wir nehmen als erstmal Peroxid. Ist dein Ernst? Hat's oh mein Gott, sie will das wirklich. Ah, viel Spaß. Oh. I'm good. I'm fine. Now the fun part. Oh, scheiße. Showed me. Alter, willst du mich verarschen? Oh. 
Ja. Alter. Boah, Leute, mir ist sogar extrem schlecht dabei geworden, ganz ehrlich. Boah, ich spüre ihren Schmerz. Alter. Oh, shit. Alter. Die Bandage, los. Du hast es geschafft, meine Süße. Die Bandage. Oh shit. <lacht> Scheiße. Alter. Nimm dieses Ding! Alter! Oh my gosh! Oh my god! Holy shit! What the? How the hell did he get in here? Little girl's tough as nails. Are you all right? I'm still not bitten. <laughs> I never was. And you left me out here to die. You patched yourself up? Where'd you get that stuff? Did she steal from us? This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. Says the man not carrying a baby. Enough already. You left me no choice. You could have just left. Relax, Rebecca. Bring her in, and I'll take a look at her arm. Damn lurkers sneaking around out here. We better get inside. You hungry? Alter, wie krass. Boah, Leute, das mit dem Schleicher, bzw. mit der Zombie war krass. This might hurt a little. Ow. How she look? Her suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So, it wasn't a lurker bite? If it was, the fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof.
I wish you wouldn't have done what you did. I was hurt, and you weren't helping. Because we considered you a threat, which you were. Maybe you still are. No, I'm not. We put you in that shed out of concern for the safety of our loved ones. And then you escaped and persuaded my daughter to steal from us. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt, but there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially, but once you're around her for a while, you'll understand. If she knew how bad the world is, what it's really like out there, she would cease to function. She's my little girl. She's all I have left, and I would ask that you stay away from her. I'm sorry. I didn't know. It's okay. You're forgiven. Just don't make any more mistakes. Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. Hey, Wahnsinn. Ich liebe dieses Game einfach. Better than losing it. Now you can say that again. Scars? They're way cooler than stumps. Oh, scheiße. What? Nothing. I just had a friend who lost his arm once. Oh, Lee! Lee! <laughs> Hey, look. I just want to say I'm sorry for well, for being a dick out there. I got kind of aggro, and that was definitely not cool. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely had one out there. You were just protecting your friends. I get it. Well, I didn't mean to be so harsh. I just... Uh, we had a bad experience once. We've all had bad experiences. Nick lost his mom. We took care of someone who got bit. It was my fault. It was no one's fault. We thought we could control it, but we couldn't. And then she turned, and his mom was standing right there, and she got attacked. And there was nothing we could do about it. Anyway... Hopefully you understand. I do. Yeah. Wow. Krasse Sache, ganz ehrlich. Und man kommt so, gar... since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I'm thinking about moving on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Okay, let yourself heal up. Take some time to sort things out. Do you think everyone else will be okay with it? They'll just have to deal with it. That's kind of nice. So, what happened to your parents? If you don't mind me asking. Oh, shit. And I assume what happened to them is... What happened to just about everyone's parents? You're just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but maybe you did. Other people took care of me, if that's what you're asking. I was just curious on how you made it this far. I just tried to stay with good people and not do anything dumb. Hey, I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have asked. Parents went on vacation and left me with a babysitter. And they never came back. We went to Savannah to find them, but they were already dead. Wow. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. 
This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors and we all tried to make it. But it didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. He taught me how to shoot a gun. What uh, happened to him? The same thing that happens to everyone, but he saved me first, lots of times. Well, sounds like he was a real good guy. Yeah, he was. Oh, ich hab so Gänsehaut gerade. Übelste Gänsehaut. Alter. I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, it's time to turn in anyways. Now get your winks while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. A couple fresh brookies for dinner? Mm, wouldn't that be nice? Auf jeden Fall. Leckere Fische sind immer gut. Alter, so ein krasses Game, Leute. Ich liebe dieses Spiel. Oh, you're still here. Was willst du denn? Kackbratze. I wouldn't get comfortable if I were you. Luke invited me to stay. Good for him. But that's not how things work around here. We make decisions as a group, and you're wearing out your welcome. You got what you came here for. Now go. Was mit dir? Blöde Kuh, ey. Aber dieses Game ist wirklich Hammer. Und der erste Teil war sowieso Bombe. Ich hab's geliebt. So, jetzt sind wir hier im Wald und gehen Fische angeln. How you holding up? I heard you got an earful from Rebecca last night. Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. Her bark's worse than her. What's her problem? Yeah, she's got a lot on her mind lately. Bringing a baby into a world like this. Sie weiß nicht mal von wem das Kind ist. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. Anyone teach you how to shoot? Yeah. By that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. My friend Lee taught me. That's good. It's important nowadays. Mm. Wissen wir. Und Lee hat es uns auch beigebracht. Nick was about your age. First time I took him hunting. Came across this beautiful 13 point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle, he lines up the shot just like I taught him, and then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. What a baby. Hey! <laughs> Why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. Anyway. So I grab the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang, the gun fires. Boy nearly gut shot me. And of course the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Cause you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I apologized already. She accepted. Okay, well I didn't know that. It's fine. He apologized. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Alter, beruhigt euch. Again. I know where the fucking river is. Poor so gentleman. anyway, I found that buck later that season. Got it right <laughs> in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play a role. Even if it means people you love hate you for it. He doesn't hate you. Nick's father wasn't there much. And he was a piece of shit when he was. So it fell to me to keep him in line. Raise him right. 
meant I couldn't just be nice Uncle Pete. Uncle Pete! Oh shit! What the fucking hell Nick. is he loose? Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Alter! Ah, full of holes. Who do you think did this? Not sure yet, but it ain't your average gang of thugs, that much I know. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? Carver, can't you do von dingens? Check those guys there. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. Der Carver ist wohl dann der Governor. <lacht> Kennt ihr den von der Serie? Ich glaube, das ist dann der. Ach, wie geil. Ich liebe dieses Game. Wir checken natürlich in der nächsten Folge die Leichen. Und ich hoffe, dass es euch gefallen hat, meine Lieben. Und die Serie ist doch einfach mal hammergeil, oder? Äh, das Spiel. Die Serie sowieso. Aber das ist Wahnsinn. Und ich feiere das so krass. Alter, wie geil. Ich hab's vermisst, irgendwie doch zu spielen. Also ich hoffe, dass es euch gefallen hat, meine Lieben. Und wir sehen uns bei der nächsten Aufnahme. Also bis dann. Tschüss.